it's easier to make $30,000 a month than it is to make $30,000 a year. First thing we gotta understand is this thing called, I call the time and money paradox. So the time and money paradox says it's easier to make a lot of money in a little bit of time than it is to make a little bit of money in a lot of time. It's easier to make $30,000 a month than it is to make $30,000 a year. How many of y'all believe that? Cool. It's also easier to make $30,000 in a week than it is to make $30,000 in a month. $30,000 in a week is only $120,000 in a month. That's just a little over a million dollars a year. So we had Thanksgiving one time at my sister-in-law's house and we was talking about something. And I was like, we started talking about money and I was like, $100,000 a month. They was like, $100,000 in a month? I'm like, that's only $1.2 million a year. And they said the same thing. He's talking about his own way. That's not that much money. Well, you don't get it if you think it's a lot of money. It's also easy to make $30,000 in a day than it is to make $30,000 in a week. I'm really finna lose some of y'all now. It's also easy to make $30,000 in an hour than it is to make $30,000 in a day. All right, let's do some math. Let's do some math. Cause one thing we know, math is always right. Always. So let's do some math. So in America right now, let's say corporate America, if somebody make this amount of money in an hour, what's considered good money? I'm saying in an hour, like in a corporate, in corporate America. $30 an hour, like a job, yeah, yeah. 30, 20, 100. Let's go at 100. So if somebody wants to make $30,000 a year and they make $100 an hour, they gotta work how many hours? They gotta work 300 hours. Let's say you have something you sell for 5,000, right? How many of y'all got something you sell for 3,000 to $10,000 or more? Cool, raise your hand high please. How many of you don't have something you sell for 3,000 to $10,000 or more? How many of you have some knowledge or expertise that's valuable? Perfect. So why aren't you packaging that and selling it for 3,000 to $10,000 or more? Fear. Nobody talk until today, fear. Thank you, honestly, right? It's the fear. So let's say you had an offer you sell for $5,000. Let's say one out of 10 people you talk to buy. You would only have to speak to about 60 people. And let's say you did this from home in your pajama pants, chilling, house shoes. You had to speak to 60 people. Let's say on average, those calls take about 45 to 60 minutes. You work 60 hours and make $30,000 that month versus working 300 hours. Y'all see how the math work? 